Hi, Emma. Hello, Emma. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? Hi, teacher. What did Ready you, for the class. What did you do today? Um, I was, I was, um, resolved, uh, a travel with my car. Oh, what happened with your car? It's damaged. Oh, no. What is it? Yes. The motor or the radiator? Um, me mechanic part. Oh, it's the motor. Yes. Oh, that's terrible. Yes. It's expensive too. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. Yes. Well, I hope you get it resolved. Okay, thanks. Thank you. Hello, Ricardo. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. What did you do today? Fine. What did Very you do? Good. What did you do? Uh, I work every day. <laughs> and what do you do at work? Corte Suprema de Justicia. No, no, no. What, what do you do? What do you do? Ah, it's the IT technologies. And in your IT technologies, do you fix computers? What do you give maintenance? What do you do? Yes, computer and nets. Software. Uh, see. Connections. Yes. Yes. Processes. No. Connection is um, my area. Okay. Okay. Hey, Morena, how are you? Hi, teacher in classmate. Uh, fine. Thank you. And you? Welcome. Welcome. <laughs> what what did you do today? I I work very where uh, difficult. Wh where do you work? <laughs> um, Ministerio de Hacienda. Uh, what do you do? Um, um accountant. Oh, nice, nice. And right now, everybody uh -huh. has to do the the income tax report. I have to do it. I, I have to go. Maybe I will see you there in the IRS department. <laughs> <laughs> I have to go. Hello, Ana Cecilia. How are you? Hello, Carlos Villanueva. Hello, Hi. teacher. Hi, how are you? I'm fine. How was your day? How Excellent. What did you do today? Um, I was work in prepare you for I am tax um, auditor. Excellent. Do you like taxes? I love. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hello, Carlos. How are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Um, hi. How was your day? Um, my day was so hard in my work. What do you do in your work? 
Um, I uh, I work at upholstery and I repair some furniture today. Yeah. Oh, so cool. So cool. Yes. Hello, Cecilia. How are you today? Hello. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Bye. Bye. How was your day? I said, I have a fire day. Oh, a, a tiring day. Yes, yes. A lot of work, a lot of money. Yes. That's good. That's yes. good. That's that's the objective. Yes. I like it. I like it. All yes. right. Welcome, everybody. Welcome. Mario mm, Ernesto, Carlos, okay. how are okay. you? How are you, teacher? Tell me, what information do you remember from yesterday's class, Mario? Uh, mm, mm, uh, español me acabo de meter, pero no sé qué, perdón. Ah, ok. ¿Qué se acuerda de la clase de ayer? Es que lo que pasa es que como ha estado algo enfermo de la tos, teacher. Ah, ok. Entonces okay. me cuesta y, y aquí estoy con la compañía también. Hey, what's going on, little buddy? Ok, that's ok. <laughs> who can tell me, who can tell me what information do you oh. remember from yesterday's class? Ok. One example. Morena? Um, simple, simple pass. A statement with regular verbs. Very good. Very huh? good. Simple past statements with regular verbs. Emma, what do you remember from yesterday's class? Things people hate to do. Things people hate to do. Very mm -hmm. good, Emma. Ricardo, what do you remember from yesterday's class? Ricardo, do you remember anything from yesterday's class? Things people hate to do, past activities. Maida, what do you remember from yesterday's class? Okay. I think they have bad connection. All right, so today we're going to be looking at the first activity. Read number one for me, Emma. Read number one, this one. Oh, your, side, your microphone is on mute. Whoa. It's on mute. On Friday night, I waited for a phone call. Perfect. Morena, read the next one. But but my girlfriend didn't call. Thank you. Continue, Carlos. On Saturday, I visited my friend Frank. Perfect. The next one, Celia. Okay. Cecilia Romero, the next one. No puedo. Hola, me escucha. Yes. Ah, okay. We talk and listen to music. Perfect. Okay. Perfect. Mario Ernesto, continue. Uh, in the evening, he invited some friends over and we cook it. 
a great meal. Very good. Repeat after me. Invited. 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 Cooked. 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 Very good. All right, Maida, the next one. <coughs> Maida, the next Dino one. Dino work. That's right. Read this sentence. Read the sentence. Okay, Ricardo, read the sentence. Uh, I didn't work very hard on Sunday. Excellent. Arnoldo, the next one. I didn't study. Okay. Yes. Uh, didn't, didn't study at all. At all. Thank you. Continue, Yesenia, the last one. <clears throat> I, I just went to the mall and shop it. And shop it. Every, uh, repeat, shop. 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 Walked. 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 Stopped. Shop. Walked. I walked. just walked to the mall and shopped. Shop. Okay. Now we're going to look at, by the end of this class, you will learn to sound natural when using regular simple past verbs. Al final de esta clase aprenderán a sonar natural cuando usen verbos regulares en pasado simple. <coughs> Listen, please. Listen to the pronunciation, please. This class Can you hear? When pronouncing simple Can you hear? The ED Can you hear? Ending of simple past yes, teacher. Yes, okay. teacher. yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Let's listen. And practice. These verbs end in t worked, watched. These verbs end in d cleaned, stayed. These verbs end in id invited, visited. In order to understand when we'll have a t, d, or it sound, we need to understand a couple of concepts. Voiceless and voice sound. So let me explain that. I would like for you to pay attention to my throat and my fingers. I'm going to put two fingers on my throat, particularly on my Adam's apple. I would like for you to do the same as well. Now I would like for you to repeat after me. Watch turn watch turn watch turn watch turn whenever we pronounce the verb watch there is no vibration on our Adam's apple this is called a voiceless sound however whenever we pronounce the verb turn there is lots of vibration on my Adam's apple. This is called a voice sound. For example, visit has a T sound. So we pronounce the past as visited. Len has D sound. So we pronounce the past as landed. Let me show you more examples of words that are voiceless and voice to help you understand this topic better. 
Another method to use is following this particular sounds. These sounds are voiceless. P, K, S, H, C, H, G, H, T, H, S, S, C, X. Let's pronounce these words now. I would like for you to repeat them after me. Helped, looked, washed, watched, laughed, breathed, kissed, danced, fixed. The following consonants have voice sound. L, N, R, G, V, S, W, Y, Z. Let's pronounce these words now. I would like for you to repeat them after me. Called, cleaned, offered, damaged, loved, used, followed, enjoyed, amazed. Now it's your turn to practice. I would like for you to pronounce all of these words. And then record yourself using the website bokaroo.com. After you finish this activity, share the list. All right, everybody, listen and repeat. Wanted. 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 Needed. 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 Wanted. 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 Needed. 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 Helped. 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 Hold. Hold. Look. 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 Cleaned. Cleaned. Washed. Washed. Offered. Offered. Watched. Watched. Damaged. Damaged. Laughed. Loved. Breathed. Breathed. Used. Kissed. Followed. Followed. Danced. Enjoyed. Enjoyed. Fixed. Fixed. Amazed. Amazing. Amazing. <coughs> All right. Amazing. So, so what you're going to do is you are going to look at all these words and you're going to pronounce the words and you are going to record yourself on vocaroo.com. You're going to go right here and you're going to go vocaroo, vocaroo. You're going to go Vocaroo online. And you're going to say the words. Watched. Listened. Walked. <coughs> laughed. Worked. Kissed. Wanted. Landed. And then you are going to copy. And you're going to go over here in the discussion forum. Añadir, you're going to put titulo, pronunciation. Past, ED. And then you're going to paste. And then you're going to enviar. So that later I can click, click. And I can hear. Watched, listened, walked, laughed, worked, kissed, wanted, landed. Any questions? Any questions? No. No, no thank teacher. you. All right. You can work in pairs. You will have five minutes. New groups, new groups.
Hi, Arnoldo. You can share your screen. Hi. Hello. Hola. Puede compartir la pantalla, Arnoldo. Mm, no. no, porque lo, lo tengo en diferente teléfono. Ah, bueno. Uh -huh. Yo, este, quiero ver si puedo yo. Oh, Porque tengo, ¿Usted lo tiene tendré... por, por medio de computadora? Sí, la tengo, pero este, tendríamos que ocupar el, el, el tablero del, del, vi, del video, el pero... verde, ¿verdad? Sí, pero yo le tomé un screenshot y creo que la... ya voy a inventar algo aquí, permítame. Creo que sí la vamos a lograr hacer. Ajá. Permítame. Ah, ese cabal. Lo puede leer ahí, sí, ¿verdad? Sí. Le voy a, le voy a tomar una foto. Ok, ya. Yeah. Ya. Yeah. Sí, entonces hay que entrar al 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 al, vo, al vocaro. Vea, y grabar no, ahí la, 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 la pronunciación, pero si quiere practiquemos. Ajá. Practiquemos y lo y lo y ya lo, lo, lo grabamos. Lo, Después lo grabamos, grabamos allá. Ajá. Practicamos una dos veces. Entonces eh, es help, help. Ajá, con, como con T al final. Help. Ajá, help. Help. Ajá. Help. Ajá. Look. Ajá. Look. look. No, look. At. No, no tiene que pronunciar la E, no que solo look. At. Ah, look. Con T, Ajá, casi no. con T. Ah, por eso dice que tiene T, vea. Entonces, Ajá, exacto, es, pero, pero help. vaya, digamos, help, pero help. en help, al final va como a terminar pronunciando la T. La T. Help. Ajá. Help. Es, bueno, así lo entiendo yo, no sé si el teacher nos puede corregir lo que nos escucha. Look. Ajá, look. Watch. 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 It. Ajá, watch. It. Watch. It. Ajá. Eh, love. It. Bread. Lunch. Lunch. Bread. Bread. Kit. Dance. Dance. Eh, fight. Uh -huh. Y el otro es con debe. Ajá, uh -huh, ahí sí. Cold. 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 Cled. Clean. 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 Offer. Uh -huh. Offer. Damage. O Dimat. ¿Cómo es? No. Damage. 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 El otro uh -huh. es Love. 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 Uh -huh. Use. No. Used. 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 Eh. Oh. Follow. Follow. Uh -huh. Enjoy. 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 Uh -huh. Y amazed. Uh -huh. Amazing. Amazing. Ama amazing. Amazed. Uh -huh. Amazed. Amazed. Uh -huh. Bueno. 
Bueno, lo voy a hacer yo. Re, repítalo usted primero, Arnoldo, para oírle su pronunciación. Bueno, lo voy a hacer yo. Ok. Ay, ya lo voy. Ay, que ya va a terminar. Ya vamos. Ya te hacemos. <risa> Ay, sí. oh, bueno, es que pero si lo puedes poner tampoco, después. Te... Sí, sí, ajá, eso voy ajá. a hacer. Gracias. Bueno, bueno. A, ahorita Gusto. solo la dejo de compartir, ¿verdad? O sí, sea, bueno, que al volver a entrar ya, ya no comparte a nadie más, porque como solo estábamos ah, pues sí, los dos. Ya, ya creo. Ah, está bien, un gusto. Oh, igual. Ay, no, pero salí de lo que... A, a ver a quién tiene. Ah, ya vamos a. No, ah, entró este Jackie. Jackie. Hola, hola. Hola, Jackie. Yo estaba, yo estaba con otro Estamos. compañero, pero me, me apareció aquí ahorita esto. Que me volviera ah, a unir. Vaya. Welcome. 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 Thank you. Welcome to this group. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Bye. Vaya. Ahora quizás que, que, repite, que empiece Ceci, ¿verdad? Ok, gracias. Thank you, Morenita. ¿Cuánto? ¿Y de cuánto es el grupo? Yo veo varios. Llenamos un bus. <risa> yo en el anterior, o sea, en el grupo. No, sí, que hay que hacer una excursión. Yo estaba, Solo éramos yo, dos. Yo estaba junto con Jacqueline. Ajá, ajá. Ah, pues, yo. welcome. Welcome. <risa> <risa> Vaya, Ceci. Bueno, wanted, needed, wanted, needed, help it, help, help, help it, it. look, 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 what, 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 no, what, what, Loud. 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 Break. 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 Cold. 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 Clean. Clean. Offered. Offered. Damaged. Damaged. Loved. 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 Used. 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 Follow with. Follow with. Enjoyed. Enjoyed. Amazed. 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 Ok, very good, Ceci. Ay, gracias. Ah, pues por eso me pusieron en este grupo, para que aprenda bien. No. <risa> Malía. Es que es <risa> Ahora ya aquí, ¿verdad? Se anima y aquí, ahí vamos a repetir después de usted. Vaya, vaya, está bien. Está bien. Voy. Si no me corrigen, pues. De acuerdo. Claro. <ríe> claro. Vaya. Help. Help. Look Con help. la T. Help. Look. Así, Look. haciendo Look. el sonido Look. de la T. Con la D. Ajá. Look. Con... No, pero ese es haciendo el sonido de la T. Uh -huh. Ah, va. Uh -huh. Help. Look. Ajá. Look. 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 Watch. Look. Watch it. Watch, watch it. it. Uh, watch it. Watch, watch it. it. Loud. 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 Esta no estoy segura. Si es Braid. Braid. Brit. Ah, Brit. No. Brit. Brit. Brit, estamos diciendo, ¿verdad? Creo que sí. 
Oh, sí, Brit. 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 Uh -huh. Kiss. 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 Dance. 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 Fix. 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 Cold. No, es en cal, cal, es cal. cold. Cold. Ah, cold. 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 Sí. Clean it. Clean it. Clean. 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 Offer. 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 Damage. 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 Love. Love. Te dio de que me sacó de la reunión. Ajá. Ah. Sí, yo entré bien tarde y exactamente me encontré con el grupo pequeño. Pero están, ¿en qué, ¿en qué están ahorita? Yo me quedé ayer trabajando un poco en la plataforma. All right. Let me hear one volunteer. One volunteer. Somebody. One volunteer. Roxana Michelle. Sanchez. <laughs> Okay. Um, uh, I read all the the words. Correct. Or... Oh, okay. Um, wanted, needed, helped, looked, watched, watched, loud, breathed, kissed, danced, fixed. Called, uh, cleaned, offered. That's I don't know how I can pronunciation. I <laughs> uh, damaged, loved, used, um, followed, enjoyed, amazed. Excellent, That's excellent, all. perfect, Emma. Okay, teacher. Go ahead. Uh, wanted, needed, helped, looked, watched, watched, loved, breathed, kissed, danced, fixed, called, cleaned, offered, damaged, loved, used, followed. Enjoyed, amazing. Only that. Excellent, excellent work. Very good, perfect. Myra. Um, boilers or boises? Oh. Teacher. Yes. Okay. Boilers. How? Look. Wash. Watch. Laughs. Breathe. Kiss. Dance. Fix. Cool. Clean. Offer. Damage. Love. Use. Follow. Enjoy. Amaze. Perfect. Amazed. Very good. All right. Now, what we're going to do is look at the following one. For the following one, you're going to move forward and look at section number 4.7. Right here. By the end of this class, you will learn how to form positive and negative statements in the simple past using irregular verbs. Al final de esta clase, ustedes aprenderán a formar oraciones positivas y negativas en pasado simple usando verbos irregulares. Verbos irregulares. Listen, please. As you learn to form positive and negative statements using irregular verbs. 
Let's get started by listening and practicing these statements in the past using irregular verbs. Simple past statements. Irregular verbs. I did my homework. I didn't do laundry. You got up at noon. You didn't get up at 10 o'clock. He went to the museum. He didn't go to the library. We met our classmates. We didn't meet our teacher. You came home late. You didn't come home early. They had a picnic. They didn't have a party. In English, we have two types of verbs. In our last class, we learned how to use regular verbs and learned the simple rule of adding ed to change those verbs to the past tense. We also have irregular verbs, which are more complicated because there really isn't a particular rule to follow. You will need to learn them and memorize them. To form positive statements in the past using irregular verbs, we will follow the same formula as with forming positive statements with regular verbs. Subject plus verb in the past tense plus complement. On these charts, you can see a few examples. If you notice the positive statements have the verbs in the past tense, and the negative statements have the verbs in the present tense. For example, the past of the verb do is did, get up, the past is got up, go, the past is went, meet, the past is met, come, the past is came, have, the past is had. Let's analyze the first example. I did my homework. First we add the subject I, then we include the verb in the past tense, did. Finally, we add a complement, homework. To form negative statements, we will follow this formula. Subject plus didn't, the auxiliary didn't, plus verb in the present, plus complement. I didn't do laundry. First, we add the subject I. Then we add the auxiliary verb to form negative statements in the past. Didn't. After that, we add the verb in the present. Do. Finally, we add the complement. Laundry. Now it's your turn to practice. I would like for you to make positive and negative statements using these irregular. All right, for this activity, you're going to give me at least five examples using these verbs in the simple past. Five examples, and you're going to share them here in the discussion forum. Any questions? Remember, you can share your screen and you can use the same examples as your partners. Share the screen and use the same examples as your partners. una pregunta. Ajá. Okay. Hola, Carlitos. 
Hola, buenas noches. Tal vez me pueden ayudar a resolver esta pregunta. Eh, ¿Por qué en algunos casos, no, bueno, no sé si yo entendí mal, en algunos casos como que el verbo se pone en, en pasado y otro se pone como en presente? Ah, cuando está negativa. Cuando le ponemos negativo, el verbo queda, queda como en presente. En presente. Uh -huh. Por y eso también cambia. cuando es interrogativa, ¿verdad? Cuando es ah, interrogativa es, también, ¿verdad? Esa sí ah. no me recuerdo, Morenita. Sí, o sea que, que en no, por ejemplo, si le dices comiste, no, comiste. did Ajá. you eat, el verbo uh -huh. está en presente. Ajá. Fuiste, did you go, correct, y es pregunta. Uh -huh. Ok, muchas gracias. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Sí. Utilizamos el auxiliar, did. El did. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Como ahí va, lleva el no. Uh -huh. Y está negativo. Uh -huh. Y uh -huh. cuando no estamos ni interrogando ni negativa, entonces usamos el verbo en pasado. Uh -huh. Para responder. ¿verdad? Sí. Sí, así entiendo. Para responder. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Vale. De acuerdo. Bueno, yo había hecho estas. La primera mía era: I awoke happy in, in energy. Compartir la Yo feliz y con energía. Pues sí, yo le estoy compartiendo humildemente. No, Ay, la pantalla, la pantalla, la pantalla. No sé, no la las había. Ah, no las compartí. Ah, pues uh -huh. perdónenme. Ah, ahí está. Hoy sí. Okay. Hoy sí. Bye. Bye. Entonces, yo la primera que había puesto era I awoke. Happy and energy. Yo desperté Hola. feliz con mi energía. Los Muy lunes. bien, Morenita. Es porque es jueves, por eso. Es ah, yo pensé es jueves, que, sí. Yo pensé que los lunes. Es no, es solo por el ejemplo, pero nada que ver. Uh -huh. Vaya, ¿Y ustedes habían hecho otras? Yo ahorita estaba haciendo una. Ah, vaya. Este, este. Ya la otra era uh -huh. así, el ejemplo que está dando Carlitos, ¿verdad? De que como es este... Negativo. Negativa. Ya Carlitos este negativo. Va en, en fix. Ajá. Ay, yo en fix your clothes. Uh -huh. Sí, sí, yo, sí. Yo había hecho una, lo único que la tengo escrita en mi libreta, eh, pero yo había hecho... I didn't have a dog when I was a leader. ¡Qué difícil! ¿Por qué? No. I didn't Ajá. a dog when I was a leader. Yo, yo creo que en yo... esa, yo creo que en esa al final no es uh -huh. a little, sino que es a child. A child. Sí, a okay. child. When ah, I was a child. Ajá. When I was a child. Sí, sí. Gracias. Ajá. Uh -huh. Pero soy honesta en decirles que casi no, no entendí qué significa. Y bueno, yo sé si me pueden ayudar. Bueno, I, así I, despacito. I didn't uh -huh. have a dog. Yo es, no tuve un perro. Un perro. Uh -huh. Yo no, uh -huh. no tuve un perro. ¿Y el que estaba ah, ladrando? Hoy sí entendí. Ah, pero cuando estaba ah, pequeña. Sí. Bueno. Como ya lo dijo, ya lo entendimos. Ah, okay. <risa> sí, ya. When I was a child. Cuando yo estaba pequeña. Ah, uh -huh. sí. sí. Uh -huh. bueno. Ah, ya. Sí, morenita. Sí, hoy, hoy sí. sí entendimos. Sí, sí. Gracias, Ceci. De nada. Vaya. ¿Quién más? Bueno, yo, te, yo hice otra. Uh -huh. este, ahí la pueden ver. I drank orange juice yesterday. Porque como el, el presente es drink, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Entonces uh -huh. ya, ya en pasado, drank. Uh -huh. drank. Entonces I drank orange uh -huh. juice yesterday, ¿verdad? Yes. Sí, yo tomé yes. jugo de naranja ayer. Yes, uh -huh. excelente. Ajá, yo, yo hice otra de uh -huh. I eat, pero no sé si así es. I eat uh -huh. cake uh -huh. yesterday. Yo creo que es. Eat. 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 Le puse 
eight, eight, ah. Entonces es I, I, eight, sí. cake, yesterday. Ajá, pero el... Eh, el verbo este, en pasado es eh, sí. eight. Ajá. Ajá, ajá, por eso, e, e, a, e, a, t, e, d, o no. Porque se, se escucha pronunciación que ver? termina en, en d, en d. Ajá. Ed. 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 pero no sé cómo se pronuncia. Ay. Ahí está el teacher, ya nos va a decir. Ah, <risa> teacher. <risa> no, no. Carlitos, teacher. es bien avanzado Carl... también. Ah, pues Carlitos, que uh -huh. me ayude. El pasado de it es... Solo le agregamos la ed. De ir de comer. Ajá, de comer. Uh -huh. No, yo creo no, que es eight. Yo creo que es, ajá, aquí Cambia. lo estoy eight. buscando. Ajá, yo creo eight. que es eight. 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 A. Pero se escribe. A. T. E. Ajá. Ajá. Eight. Ajá, o sea, por eso al, 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 es, es la misma palabra, pero solo le agregamos la ed. No, 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 se, no, como, no es irregular, uh -huh. como es irregular, se escribe de otra forma. Escribir ahí en la pantalla, ah, Morenita. Ajá, sí, Morenita, porfa. Y... Escribirle en la pantalla, Morenita, así como hace el teacher. Es cole. Ah, vale, porque... ah, wow. El teacher está buscando, está, está reclutando. No, futuro no, no, maestro. Sí, 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 ya, sí. ya vi ah, la candidata. No les sí. había entendido, sorry. Ah, y se pronuncia eight. 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 Entonces, I eight. ate cake yesterday. Wow. Ajá, yo comí pastel ayer, ¿verdad? Eight. Yes. Delicious. Mm -hmm. ay, ay. Ay, okay. I ate cake. <laughs> I ate cake yesterday. Yesterday. Yes. Yes. Yo tengo una que no sé si me pueden decir si está bien. Ok. Uh, Morenita te va a decir si está bien. No, Alexis. <ríe> Vaya, Carlitos. Vaya, uh, sería He didn't wash his car yesterday. He didn't, 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 didn't wash Él no lavó Él no el lavó carro, el carro. Ayer. Uh -huh. yes, 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 yes. See, yes. it's correct. It's correct. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Ay, ves. <laughs> <laughs> Ay, yo creo otra. que en, en la otra etapa morenita me va a salir de modesto. No, no, no. Sí. <laughs> <laughs> yo tengo una. A ver. Hola. Uh -huh. I saw down. It was wonderful. I saw down, o sea, yo vi el amanecer. Ah, okay. I saw the verb. Ajá, Ajá. ¿Mm? porque es ese A W, ¿verdad? Ajá. Ajá, sí. So, down. Ajá. down, yo sí la encontré, eh, como sí. el amanecer. Así estoy viendo, yo no sabía que así se decía. Y down, down was, qué? I saw down. It was wonderful. Yo sí, yo creo que está bien. Está perfecta esa oración. Ajá, y era maravilloso, ¿verdad? Al sí, final. Sí, uh -huh. sí, es, era maravilloso. Ajá. Yo vi el amanecer y era maravilloso. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ajá. Yes. Sí, sí, bien completa. Sí, <ríe> está bien completa esa oración. No sabía que sí, se, esa sí. palabra tampoco yo. Sí. La, 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 la aprendí ahora también yo. Ajá. Después la aprendimos entonces. La aprendimos, la aprendimos, sí. la aprendimos definitivamente. Ok. Ay. No sé, ¿quién tiene otra? Alexis. Alexis. Tú no tienes. You can share your screen. Excellent.
ok, teacher, ahorita estábamos haciendo eh, las oraciones con eh, los verbos en pasado, ¿verdad? Y solo teníamos yes. una duda respecto, por ejemplo, si usamos el verbo auxiliar did, uh -huh. eh, es cuando se coloca así el verbo en pasado, ¿verdad? Pero, por ejemplo, si es en negativo, es el verbo que lo acompaña en presente o en pasado. Ah, ok. Eh, si usa did, for example, you say, I did my homework. Allí el verbo es did. Pero si le uh -huh. hago did you do your homework, en pregunta, allí el verbo va en presente. O did you eat? En pregunta. Ok. Y si solo son oraciones, digamos una en negativa, puede ir el verbo en, en pasado. Correct. Depende de la, de la... I didn't de... eat pupusas. I didn't go to the gym. I didn't cook. Allí en el auxiliar el verbo va en presente. Ok. Y puede ir el auxiliar también en eh, no el auxiliar, bueno, sí, ¿verdad? Porque en este caso, did es el verbo y el auxiliar es el otro verbo, ¿verdad? Correct. Entonces, el otro verbo también puede ir en pasado, o sea, que tiene esa función eh, en estas estructuras, ¿verdad? Yes, correct. Ok, teacher, gracias. Excellent, excellent. All right, we're going to go ahead and move forward, guys. We're going to finish real quick. Let me have one volunteer. Emma, let me hear your examples. Emma, let me hear your examples. Okay, teacher. Number one. Yes. I did exercise yesterday in the afternoon. Excellent. Number two, I got up at 6 a.m. yesterday. Very good. Number three, I went to the supermarket with my daughter. Perfect. Number four, I had flu last week. Awesome. Uh, number five, I met new classmates on weekend. Very good. Number six, I came to twice to the park yesterday. Only that. Okay, perfect, perfect. Select somebody, Emma. Cecilia Romero. Cecilia Romero. Thank you. <laughs> Why, okay. Yes. Bueno, me corrige, por favor. Por yes. teacher. Yes, of okay. course. My. One. One. I, uh -huh. Number one. Number one. Okay. I did drink juice orange. No, 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 no. no. I said, yeah, I drank orange juice. I drank orange juice. I drank. Oh. Orange juice. I drank orange juice. Oh, in the juice. negative, I didn't drink, drink orange juice. Okay. And the question, did oh. you drink orange juice? Oh. In the question. Excellent. Thank you, Cecilia. Another okay. example, Myra. Okay. 
Okay. I. I did not clean the house yesterday. Maria has new shoes. She did not choose clothes. Excellent, excellent. Arnoldo Castellón, very good. Arnoldo Castellón, let me hear your examples. Okay, me corrige si están, están malas. Okay. Okay. Uh, number one. I did my work. Uh, number two. I got up early today. Number three. I went to work every day. No. Okay. I went to work. Ah, falta this two. Morning. Ajá, no puede decir I went to work every day. Mm -hmm. Estoy diciendo fui a trabajar ahora en la mañana. I went to work this morning. Porque está hablando de un tiempo específico en el pasado. Pero si dice mm -hmm. every day, ya no es tiempo específico. Ahí sería yo trabajo todos los días. I work every day. Ahí sí. Es el simple present. Entonces, cambiaría el que hay. Every day. Ajá, every day. Every day no lo puede poner. Ok. I went to work yesterday, por ejemplo. Yesterday, that sería ok. Thanks, teacher. All right. Number four. Eh, I come to play basketball on the court. No, I came. Uh -huh, I came, came to I play came. basketball on the court. Okay, that's good. All right, let's mm -hmm. continue, guys. Thank you. We're going to okay. move to 4.9. Conversation instructions. Complete the conversation by using the correct form of the verbs in the past sentences. For example, did you... Enjoy it. Enjoyed your it. Did you <gasps> enjoy, enjoy your summer? summer? All right, you will have two minutes to finish this exercise. Ready? Let's do it. And I stay Jacqueline. Jacqueline. Y está Ana Cecilia. Ok. Ese ya lo resolvieron. O lo vamos a resolver. Este... Yo no lo he resuelto todavía. <risa> Yo... Yo sí, ya lo hice. Bye, bye. Bye, Carlitos. Creo <risa> que era este. ¿Qué más? Este. Bye. Ya le voy a compartir aquí la pantalla. Did you go? Ay, le voy a mandar a Ana Cecilia cómo va a compartir. Démosle. Tenemos. Vale, se, se ve. Sí, excelente. Ajá. No sé, sí, ya veo que no es necesaria la capacitación de maestro. <risa> este Alexis. Vaya. Yo, did you? Ah, oh, pero entonces. Y en el primero, ¿por qué no cambió? Ah, porque, porque es pregunta. Es pregunta. Y es pregunta. ¿Verdad? O sea que el primero no cambia. Y es pregunta. No cambia porque tenemos el auxiliar did. Como estamos usando el auxiliar. Mm, pues no eso cambia. me cuesta todavía entenderlo. 
Ajá. Sí, cuesta un poco. Es que siempre que usamos un auxiliar, tenemos que usar los verbos en presente. Así, le, así he comprendido yo esa regla. Que toda vez que vamos a hacer, vamos a usar did como auxiliar, ya sea para una pregunta o para negación, lo vamos a utilizar o en sea presente. Que, digamos... No sé si entendí. Siempre, siempre, siempre que vaya el, el did, el auxiliar, siempre se tiene que, independientemente sea pregunta, lo que sea, se tiene que poner en presente el verbo. No, no. Si pregunta y que o sea negativa. En pregunta cualquiera negativa. de los dos casos. Ah, Ajá. Okay. Sí. Así. Ok. La, la que sigue yo, este, por esa regla me había confundido un poco porque vi que tenía did, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Pero como tiene punto, hasta ahí termina la, ahí termina la, la oración. Frase. Ajá, y ahí la otra comienza este, ya, en pasado. I had. Ajá. A great sí. summer. Uh -huh. Ajá, yo tuve un gran verano, ¿verdad? Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Por eso lo pusimos así. No, este, y went. la otra. Porque igual el ejemplo que estaba dando Jackie, que ella en pasado, el pasado de Go, ¿verdad, Jackie? Que era. Went. Jackie. Ajá, la, la otra era Went. Yes. Uh -huh. The past go. Uh -huh. When. Uh -huh. Que era como la oración que estaba haciendo ya aquí, ¿verdad? La que nos dio sí. a ella. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Que es el pasado. Y el pasado de uh -huh. head, ¿qué, ¿cuál es? No me recuerdo. ¿Y de cuál? De head. ¿Cuál? En la, en la conversación 2, es que como lo estoy desarrollando, ya nos está llamando. Ah, ¿cómo? All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Hello, hello. Hello. Teacher. Hello. All right, guys, we are finished for today. Remember that tomorrow is Friday, no class. Saturday, no class. Sunday, no class until Monday. See you okay, Monday, teacher. teacher. All right, but remember that you have to continue working on the platform. There is no limit to the activities that you can work on the platform. So the more activities that you do, the better that it is for you. Okay. okay teacher. Happy weekend, teacher. Okay. All right. Have a good weekend, ladies and gentlemen. Enjoy your weekend. Have okay. a good Thank weekend. You. Thank you. Enjoy your weekend. Good night. Bye bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Work on the platform. Bye. Work on the platform. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Work good night. On, okay. Work okay. On the platform. Good night. Good night. Work on the good platform. Night. Bye bye. Bye.